And I figured if I wasn't going to do this now, I wasn't ever going to do it. Uh, unfortunately, I left from the Arboretum. It's taken me a long time to get out here. Some, I don't know whose decision it was to lock the spacewalk speed to 1.5 meters per second. It is too slow. Especially when you're just floating through nothing. It's not even realistic. You can go faster than 1.5 meters per second. You probably shouldn't in space. It's generally not considered the best of ideas, but you can go a lot faster. After this, I'm going to head back to the derelict shuttle up here, because I'm, you know, I'm out here, so I might as well have a look at that. And then I'll probably get back through the Arboretum. I think there's an e a more convenient egress point. Ingress. If you're going inside. I think Grantlock was just sort of floating out in space. He managed to get himself 600 meters away from the station. It's probably why I've never tried going after him. Anything over 300 meters is an excruciatingly long trek. I, I guess they didn't want you to just be buzzing up and down the station at, you know, 50 meters per second. But on the other hand, this is too slow. I mean, if you'd limit it to, say, 5 meters per second, I'd have been here... Oh, I'd been, I would have been less worried about the transit. Oh, good. There's radiation around Grant Lockwood. Well, I've got rad pills. Let's just close in and see. It's a lot of radiation. I'm gonna get radiation poisoning. And I can only leave here at 1.5 minutes per second. Uh, radiation poisoning detected. Seek medical attention. Let's just get away from him. Am I gonna... S I need to get away from the radiation. I didn't get any more information. Just check disgruntled employee. Is gone now. I didn't get a... Um, I didn't get a transcribe or anything from him. Hold on. When that thing goes away, I hit O, but that's okay. Let's take a radiation pill. <laughs> so many suit repair kits. And eight neuromods, which I now have to use. I also picked up a upgrade, I think, to my propulsion pack. Let's use this. That should clear me of radiation. And that might speed me up, that propulsion pack, but you got to go quite a ways out here to get there. Where was it? Gen 2. Adds a jet boost. Where's Gen 1? Unequip. Equip. Still limited. Uh, oh, I can go up to... And then it slows me down. Okay, that would have been nice to have on the way out, not on the way back. But I suppose that does something. Okay, now I can hold it at 5 meters per second. Let's push it to 10. It's my max. It automatically slows down when you're not burning. I don't know what force is acting on it. I can hear there's no jets firing. Different noise. So it's just magically slowing me down. All right, this shuttle, which has canards for some reason. Uh, Weaver. Eight. Let's deal with that. A couple of cystoids got out. I wonder if I can hit them with the Q-beam and sort of detonate them all. I think I left a few. Alright, let's see, let's have a look at this shuttle. 
I'm, I'm not sure if these um, forward canards would really be the best idea for a space shuttle. Like, aerodynamically speaking, that would cause problems in re-entry that might... You don't, like, superheating, the, the way the air works on the main, on the hull, is going to be pretty freaking substantial, and those are gonna sort of set your balance off. There's a reason the shuttles are shaped the way they are. An EMP charge, one 9mm bullet, and a transcript. Speaking of which, I did pick up a silence pistol I do not want to keep. Let's get rid of that. And finally, not the pistol, the transcribe. Let's listen to it. I don't know why I can't reach anyone, but I am dead in the water. Repeat, I have zero engines. I'm drifting. God damn it, see, vents are your transcribe. <sighs> All right. Shit. Investigating cabin. I have a sidearm. If all clear, I will attempt to EVA to an airlock. Derelict shuttle, new objective. What is the new objective? What do you want me to do here? See, this is Captain Hale, shuttle exalt. I'm trying to hail the bridge, getting zip. Can you confirm, please? I have some system malfunctions. It's, uh, it's across the board. It's hard to make sense. I need to park ASAP. I recommend security detail when I come in. Hearing some noise in the cabin. Shit, what is going on? You brought them in? No, 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 no. They were already here. That's why they set up the station. What am I talking about? Uh, they've got a bunch of the... The volunteers, quote-unquote. I'm eating their puddings off them. Uh, double check. Was there actually, uh... There's no... There's no mission, I don't know. Very well. It said there was an objective, but I don't know if I had an objective. It was just getting here, I suppose. I could try and repair the... The control panel there, I don't know... If that would be a good idea. I have not used those Typhon laws. It's just, it, with those kinds of traps things, it's just not my thing. I don't know how to use them. Every time. So several of the volunteers. Four of them. One crew member. And a space shuttle presumably bound for the station. Unpowered door. I, I see, if I could repair this... Which, I mean, in theory, I could. Repair three is eight. I've got nine. I could do that. Is it a good thing to be spending money on? Did it get me that other thing? That one in the hardware labs. And I've got to go down there near enough. I mean, I have to go back to the lobby to speak with Mikayla. Yeah, go on. I, w I, I was hoping to do more of the Typhon stuff, but uh, this isn't going to happen. God, I don't have enough spare parts for this anyway. Let's turn on emergency power. Better be something in here. <laughs> Check the other side. Weapon upgrade kit and two recycler charges. Hold on. And another Neuro mod. Ha! <sighs> now that I've turned on the emergency power, can I redock the shuttle? No. That was a lot of spare parts for that. <laughs> but at least... At least I can move around the station ex in the exterior a lot faster. That is what I was talking about. I 
The problem is I can't actually see what I'm trying to look at. There, this one. This Sputnik looking thing. I'm gonna have a I'm gonna have a nosy at this one. It's moving around. It really does look like Sputnik. Are you certain it isn't Sputnik? No, I don't think Sputnik was uh, green. Multiple objectives, airlock power plant. Where was the hardware labs? Shuttle bay. I can't. I can't highlight these uh, green ingress points. I'd like to see what they are. I need the hardware labs. And probably more spare parts. I don't know if four is going to be enough. What is that? There's the hardware labs. And that's where I'm headed. Let's burn through here and go around the cystoid nest. Oh, nearly struck the wall there. And back in here. Bypass, we'll head up back up to the arboretum through the lobby to go speak with Alex, but we'll grab whatever that satellite we've got to launch or look at is, and then we'll go to speak go to speak with Mikaela. Bet you I don't have enough. Oh, medical operators. Uh, yes, I want this. Okay. Their parts from them, at least. That might help me. I need two more. Bugger! I knew, I knew it was gonna be, uh... I can't make spare parts. Obviously. Uh, we've got a bunch of junk to recycle, so let's do that. You'd think I'd be able to make spare parts, wouldn't you? Uh, there's got to be a... There's got to be some... Somewhere. I'm going to dig around for a bit. Give me a second. No, I've got dismantle. I've got dismantle. What am I doing? What can I dismantle? One spare part from this. I can't dismantle either of these. <laughs> Guns and the like. Alright, going back. Let's find something in there to dismantle or probably... I mean, I could make guns and such in the recycler. And then just dismantle them for their parts. Though I don't want to waste the mineral resource for it. Uh, any... Like, wrenches, for instance. That'll be worth something. How do I dismantle? There we go. Right click on it. Confirm. That gives me enough spare parts. Alright, I'm going to have to start doing that more often now. Make sure I'm picking up weapons to dismantle them. That poltergeist just never bothered me. Just... I oh, know he's in here now. Um, look. Whenever you're ready to do stuff, just attack me. I'm just going to leave you for now. There's another spare part in here. Which I missed. Damn it. Well, let's repair this thing and set it off. I didn't think I had dismantle. Take the psionic translator. Find hardware communication, satellite communication device. 
place the device on the satellite on the exterior. Is that the one I had a look at earlier? The Sputnik looking one. Huh. <sighs> Running around in circles for these side objectives. I think I know what it's talking about. Exterior satellite. 378 meters away. Careful. Ah, bunked my head. Okay, it is actively moving. Not very quickly, though. 10 meters per second. This makes space more viable. I was ready to, like, start going on a rant about how the game lets you fly around in space but makes you move at a snail's pace for some ungodly reason. But you do get an upgrade for it. You shouldn't need an upgrade for it. The laws of physics don't change because of upgrades. So long as you're adding... That's where you want me to stick it, isn't it? Come on. Oh. I thought it was up there. I just said somewhere on there. Okay, now what? Incoming call from whom? Nice work. This should get the attention of that Typhon nightmare that's hunting you. I'm sending you two activation signals. The first will direct the Typhon away from you. The second will bring it down on you. Use your transcribed messaging system to fire them off. Uh, okay. How does that work? Why would I want to bring it down on me? I've got four uses of it. Why would I want to attract it? And let's check that. Data, audio logs. Attract nightmare, repel nightmare. If I activate one of this, one of these, I presume it'll do that. Well, let's just leave that in the back pocket for now. And don't accidentally hit L. Alright, back to the hardware labs. Let's get to Mikaela and face the music. I'm wondering whether I should deal with the telepaths in the lobby now. Um, yeah. Let's just... Ooh. All right, that's one telepath down. I don't know if the other one heard me. Oh crap! Can glass floors in this game? Uh, all right, that went all right. The other one's around here somewhere. Oh, if I can't find them, they're not my problem. Alright. We killed her father, but then again, we're also kind of dead. We're not the same person who did that. Mikaela will probably scream and yell at us, but I imagine it will just sort of bounce off our unemotive face. Because at the end of the day, you know... I don't actually think- I've been helping Mikaela, and January's been wondering whether or not there's some latent affection there. I don't think there is. I think that that's just... I don't, I don't think there's anything substantial there, but it isn't going to make me feel good. I don't- Preview I don't Morgan. understand. Morgan, hooked up some more supplies. Take what you need. Uh, you're gonna wish you didn't in a second. Last chance. Blows that would otherwise kill you leave you with one health instead with a five second cooldown. Uh, okay, that might be really good. Yeah, let's get rid of this. I don't need to eliminate drunken effects of alcohol. I don't drink it. And let's plug that one in. Leverage your system. Reduce the time it takes to pick up heavy objects. Nah. And don't be shy about using it. I don't think they will. I don't see the stuff you've made. Mod. I haven't had much success in calling up more fabrication plans, but I did have a design for a psychoscope chipset I've been tinkering with. I'd be honored if you found some use for it. Okay. 
Are you gonna give it to me? I'm not, I, you, maybe, you, maybe you have done. Scope chip sets? There we go. Shotgun critical. Increases the critical chance rate when firing the shotgun. Maybe. Mimic detection, speed scan. Regenerate Psy, definitely want that. No, I think, I think at the end of the day... I think at the end of the day that's fine. I don't have damage with the shotgun. Okay, let's do this. Talk. I'm feeling much better. Lights are fine. Vision's clear. Those boosters did the trick. I have more autonomy than a typical operator. The contents of the video are sensitive. Only a flesh and blood person could handle the responsibility. I'm ready, Morgan. I presume. Okay. Are you gonna are you gonna play the message? I can't or... believe you were able to find it. After all this time. So are you gonna play it or do you need me to do it? Initiating test procedure twenty nine. Variant C, subject V-0106-35-32. Self-incriminating achievement. Subject 32 is in the chamber. Psychoscope's on, everyone. Do you have a family? Prep the Typhon Cacoplasmus. I have a daughter. They took me from her. I was promised... I didn't get a chance to say I'm sorry in advance, but I am. I signed your papers. <sighs> Let's stay focused, everyone. Your family. You must hate them very much to do this. I hear it in your voices. Track his vitals. 32 is showing signs of distress. Elevated cortisol, heart rate, perspiration. Nothing in the radius. I have to listen to all of this again. I, I can't look even face her right now. I can't killing. look at her at the moment. Mimic is in the tube. Permission to release? Morgan? What you do kills us both. Release. Typhon Cacoplasma oh, specimen is in the chamber with subject 32. Subject, uh... Subject, vital signs are gone. Ooh. Make a note. Replication followed the usual pattern. Appears unaffected by the subject's age. Morgan, did you get a good scan? Yeah. Data looks good. Scrub it and send it up to me as soon as you can. I want a new design on the mimicry connectomes before I dive into the sim again. All right. You performed the procedure? The what? Killed him? And you knew? Why? And to think, more. I thought you were trying to help me. Why would you save me to do this? To buy back some guilt? So I'd forgive you? My father is right. You don't understand. Your father, mother, your stupid, deluded brother. You will never understand family. You don't even understand what it means to be human. Probably Get not the anymore. Get hell away from me. Okay. Yeah, I think I better had. Why would I have done that? Well, maybe it was because I thought it was only fair that you knew. Maybe because at the end of the day, none of us are going to survive this. At least I don't I don't I'm I don't see at the moment any evidence that anyone's going to survive. So maybe I just think that she has a right to know anyway. I don't think I was doing that just for forgiveness. I guess it doesn't, you know, she wanted to know, but maybe I could have kept that from her and that would have been moral because, you know, she didn't need to know. There's the other telepath. But that, I... I, I you know, what's, as, as I said... What would I be, what would I be saving by hiding it from her? And even if she hates me to the last, she probably had the right to know. That's my take. Oh, crap. Uh, maybe I should have fought that thing as well. Anyway.
Had to be done. He had the right to know. It's as simple as that. Let's eat up and... If we can, let's speak to our brother. And I'm not going to bother with the Igwe's side mission. I'm slightly offended at the notion that I would have done that for my own benefit. That she immediately thinks I'm trying to protect myself or ask her forgiveness. That would actually slightly bother me. Because that's definitely not the, not the reason. I heard something. I think it was a phantom. Alright. I'm out of spare parts. I should be looking for stuff to dismantle. 1578. If you push for hacking 4, you could probably get there. If you really grinded, you could probably get there before this part of the game. Alright, Alex's office. And Alex is safe. I'm going to talk to Alex first before I uh, check his safe. We'll see what he has to say. Or what he plans to do. Let's just scout around for a second. We've got the key to his safe, so we can look in there, but he'll... I'll probably wait till he either tries to stop us... Or kill us, or kills himself somehow. Pulls the old Andrew Ryan on me. Before I check his safe. Terraforming Mars. I think I've read that if I haven't, you know. Alright. Go in the front door. Just wanted to look around first. Good evening, Talos. Dr. Hadley Dalton will deliver a supplement. Thank you. I won't be joining you. Don't ah. worry, there's no trick. Just a gift from your big brother. It's the truth. Like I promised. Took me a while to dig it up. Someone wanted to hide it from you. My computer. Another video. Give it a look and we'll talk. I'm sending you the password. Assuming you haven't hacked your way in yet. Hey, you know me well, I suppose. A... Something that they've been trying to hide from me. Well, you look like you're trying to hide something from me. Like this maintenance access panel. With some... With the safe behind it. 0008. Wrong. I missed. Uh, optimizer. The... Keycard for Alex U Suite, which I will now have to go have a look at. A null wave transmitter, a neuro mod, and a transcriber. I thought Alex would be actually be in here, but I'm I'm wrong. Once things get as bad as I think they probably are, your only option is to escape. Get the word out about what's happening on Talos One. Alex has a private escape pod. It's locked up. I made a copy of the key and hid it on top of the data tower near the chair. You know the one I'm talking about. Listen, there's more at stake this time than just us or this station. Who is she talking just to? One of those creatures made it back home. Then we're lost. I keep having this dream. I'm just staring into the black between the stars. There's something there. I know there is. I just can't see it. But it sees me. I can feel it. Hate us. I know you know what I'm talking about. Or you will soon. Who was she talking to? Me? Or like her future self? Or... One of the other crew members? Well, let's see what Alex has concocted for us, and whether I believe him. Cheng Huang Shen. Utilities. Morgan 
dot LVG, that's another episode. Rooftop bridge controls. Hmm. Fabrication plan for Neuromod. I've already got that, why am I printing another one? Four emails. Results of Morgan's evaluation. From Matthias Cole, Cole to Alex Yu. I'm gonna, I'm gonna watch the video last, because I'm, I'm sort of building up towards it. Uh, your sibling is indeed different. I've sent the comparisons to you and Bellamy for evaluation. As you'll see, there's noticeable personality drift, more than I'd expect from heavy neuromod cycling. It's even more prominent because of the duration in which these behavior shifts have deployed. As requested, I did not discuss this with Morgan. Interestingly, Morgan seems unaware of these shifts. As an aside, I believe this poses interesting questions for other applications of the neuromod. Not solely therapy, but reconditioning. So... Did Alex know that reconditioning would be one of the side effects of it? And was he specifically testing that out on me? From Emma Betty to Alex Yu. Alex, you've made it my duty to keep everyone in the station in good physical condition. Last time I checked, sir, you are part of everyone on this station. By my count, you've missed the past five scheduled fitness tests. Well, he doesn't sound like the fittest individual. If you're uncomfortable, uh, if you're uncomfortable with some of the exercises and performing them in front of the crew, I can schedule you time in the fitness center where it's just the two of us. Remember, you wouldn't be doing this just to help yourself, but to set an example for the whole staff. Thanks so much, Emma Betty. Don't think he went for it. Uh, I think I've read this one. I spoke to Lorenzo Calvino and got no response, so bring the matter to you, yeah. Doubt the accident. I've read this before on news computer. From Sarah Elazar to Alex Yu. Alex, found it. Neuromod division. On top of a computer cabinet. I'd say someone was trying to hide it, along with what looks like a bug out bag. Should I be concerned about anything? It's still there, by the way. Need your help tracking down a missing key card. It should be one of your highest priorities labeled EP101. Let me know as soon as you find anything. Episode 101. I thought, I, I thought that was the name of the... No, this one. Rooftop bridge controls. I guess I'll activate this. The rooftop bridge. Not sure what that is. But, it's a bit extended. Now let's play this. Okay, main screen. This one? No, back here. 50% chance this is going to be lies. Uh -huh. My name is Morgan Yu. Year is 2035. I'm aboard the Talos One research facility. What else? Why are we making this video? Right. Because my big brother is paranoid. Psychometric data is showing statistically significant variance in personality pattern between trial runs of the new neuromods. Whatever. I feel more like myself than ever. I mean, look at this. We did it, Alex. It's real. Enjoy it while you can, because in a few minutes, it'll all be gone when we strip out the neuromods and we set. I know, I'm including my memory of it. No way around it. Let's talk about the backup. So, the Typhon organisms have been producing an elaborate structure. All right. Material is unknown. Purpose unknown. My okay. Tells me it's kind of a neural framework. It does look like I would have said Still waiting on brain patterns. In the meantime, I've given Alex the design for a device I think could shut it down if it ever broke containment. Alex just has to grow a pair and commit. You don't have to take all the credit. What if it doesn't work? It'll work. Trust me. What else are we going to do? Blow everything up? <laughs> that won't save us. And if it does work? Is it worth it? The people that come after us will be smarter, stronger, immortal. They can judge us if they want. But they'll know they exist because of the things we did. I'm ready. Do it. Hmm. <laughs> I don't buy it. It looks... See the, the, the fuzziness, the artifacts? I don't think I've seen that before. Or the... Glitching. Everything I've done it is looks what fabricated. You to do. I didn't think you'd believe me unless you heard it from your own mouth. The tests. They changed you. Not a lot 
at first, but eventually, the constant stripping of your memory. I didn't know who you were anymore. All I want is to have my sister back so we can finish what we started. The device you mentioned, it's an advanced version of the Null Wave. It's the only way to stop the Typhon without destroying everything we've been working toward. We're just missing some scan data from the Carl to complete the design. Help me finish this, Morgan. And then, you can have my arming key. I don't believe you want to use it anymore, but you can have it. I left the chip set for you on my desk. You'll need to upgrade your psychoscope to scan the Carl. I'll send you the scan locations. Hmm. Okay, well, maybe he's right. Maybe that wasn't fabricated. It looked a bit fuzzy at, on occasion, which made me think... Which, which makes it appear like it was faked. Coral Detector 64SA. I need to assign that. Uh, I should upgrade my... Uh, I'll replace speed scan. Not ideal, but... <sighs> God, I like all of this. But uh, I'll need that there. It, I mean, it sounded too much like what words that Alex would put into our mouth. But in fairness, we have changed. There's no doubt about it. So we entirely could have at one point believed that it was a good thing. But that doesn't necessarily mean that's what we believe now. And I, you know, the ultimate goal is to inject everyone with aliens in order to turn them into a super race. That certainly doesn't seem like the kind of project I want to be a part of. I don't think my mind has been changed by that. I'm still blowing up the station. Morgan, January was right. It was not you. But I keep hearing your voice and my father's voice. And... It was not you, I know. You saved me because you wanted to. That is not the same person on the recording. Something's changed. I need to see that. I'm... better now. I'll do what I can to get us off the station alive, but that log is coming with me. If you truly want forgiveness, you'll help me get it to where it belongs. No matter what that means for you, and Tronstar. Okay, can you get off the station alive? Morgan, that video was... I'm still checking it against my directives. But if scanning the coral will grant you access to Alex's arming key, then perhaps it's the best course. Perhaps knowing the coral's purpose will reinforce your decision to destroy Talos 1. Just be careful. We're running out of time. Uh-huh. Could we save Mikhail? I mean, she's... Has she installed any neuromods? Because we can't bring them back if she has. Can I not scan all this? No. Have to be, it has to be the coral nodes. Alright. What other side objectives do we have now? Search Alex's room for the escape pod key in the crew quarters. I'd have to go back to the crew quarters for that. Well, probably best I deal with the coral nodes first. Maybe if we, you know, I... Morgan said she could feel something out there hating us, presumably. Either Transtar or humanity in general, whatever. I don't think, I don't know. What does Alex think the Null Wave transmitter will do? I've been thinking about the video. Alex showed you. Your brother believed that version of you is the true Morgan, but why? Just because it came first? If someone had made you, then I suppose your truest self would be the one that fulfills whatever purpose your maker intended. I know who made me, and why. Did someone make you, Morgan? Were you made for something? If not, you'll have to invent your own purpose, or have none at all. Strangely, of all the things I know about you, I don't know what you believe. You have to decide, Morgan. 
Who are you? I think I'm the kind of person who isn't about to try to upgrade humanity wholesale in th against their will, kind of. Alex hasn't exactly been big on, you know, he's been capturing people, enslaving them, using them as volunteers. You think he's going to just allow people to opt in or out of being upgraded? I think I'm bringing the station down. Oh, shit. Okay. What was that? Uh, that was a technopath. Immediately. I can't reach you from here. Ah, uh, what now? I don't want to alarm you, but there's been a I'm already there. alarmed, Alex. Board of Directors has caught wind of the situation here. I suppose it was Kay. inevitable despite my effort. I'm in a bit of a pickle at the Just, moment. That's why it's important we act quickly and decisively. Jesus Christ! I'll try to take this out of our hands, Morgan. I'm gonna die. Uh, I can't get away from. He noticed me too far away. I can't. I can't fight him. Damn it. I wasn't prepared and he just keeps knocking me out. God, he can hit from a distance. Alright, Sam from from the beginning. About the video, and Alex. Morgan has gonna have to talk. Sorry, January's gonna have to talk through all this. If I try Why? the other node. Just try going around first. a bit, find a if someone had made more you, covered version. Then I suppose your truest self would be the one that fulfills whatever purpose your maker intended. I know who made me. And why? Did someone make you, Morgan? Were you made for something? If not, you'll have to invent your own purpose. Or have none at all. Strangely, of all the things I know about you, I don't know what you believe. You have to decide, Morgan. Who are you? Okay, I'm at the moment trying to avoid a... Uh, technopath. <laughs> Let's deal with that for now. See another one around here. A weaver, that's manageable. Dealt with before you could launch, I think. Let's grab his things. I'm running actually quite low on Q beam cells. Go to kinetic blast. I don't want to alarm you, but there's been a launch from the Argus platform. The board of directors has caught wind of the situation here. I suppose it was inevitable despite my efforts. That's why it's important we act quickly, decisively. They'll try to take this out of our hands, Morgan. Well, not much I can do about that. So they're coming up. The board is on its on its way to make its own decision. Ah, uh, fuck. Corrupted science operator. Only one. Take that out, there's a weaver at the end of the station. A human corpse over there, where am I headed? This coral node. 